precision manoeuvres, breathtaking stunts. The Red Arrows are admired the world over for their flying displays. So, for six primary school children from Bournemouth, Christchurch and Poole, a meet and greet at Bournemouth Air Festival was a pretty special occasion. Uh, firstly, congratulating you all on your amazing designs. Uh, we've been following the competition. They'd earned their spot at this encounter by designing and creating paper aeroplanes. Each of the winners adding their own personal touch to the models. I did a red arrow of a Bournemouth theme. So I added a little touch to it and it turned out like this. Me and my friends set up a charity to help try and raise an awareness about the sea and how that we need to um, take care of more of our environment. Uh, so there's some really creative designs in there, some very different ones, different shapes and sizes. Um, but the thing that was great was there were things in there that were relevant to Bournemouth, relevant to the Red Arrows, and really people using innovation um, and putting their mind to creating something that was unique. The aim of the competition was to inspire the next generation of engineers, technicians and pilots. Inspiring uh, young generations of, uh, of people into science, technology, engineering, maths or into flying or into the military is, is what we're all about in the Red Arrows. Being able to come here today, uh, judge the awards and have a look at the, the things that have been produced is amazing for us. Time for the designs to be put through their paces. Sarah Farmer, BBC South Today.